mac and cheese with uh, chicken on top. Nachos with pork on top. That's from Family Traditions Barbecue and Sweets Catering. Then we got the Philly from Game Time Philly. They got some, this is their special for the day. Some curry sauce on there. Look at that. Oh, the peppers. It smells so good. The barbecue is smelling really good. Like, that's overpowering everything else, but... Oh, man, I'm about to grub. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Mac and cheese. With smoked chicken. The chicken has a, a good smoke to it. Always good with uh, barbecue. Now the mac and cheese though, I don't see any pepper. So it could use a little more seasoning, some pep pepper, some salt, put the barbecue sauce on there. That'll help it out. Let's try these, hmm. Uh, Pork nachos. Oh, just fell apart. I tried to pick it up, fell apart. Hmm. It's okay. I mean, the meat is tender. It smells so good. I don't know. I think I need a little more flavor, though. I don't know. There's, there's something. There's a little something that's missing. I mean, overall, it, it's pretty decent. Like I, I, I'm still going to enjoy it, and yeah, <laughs> I'm going to eat it all. But just, just a little. Little missing. And again, that's family traditions, barbecue and sweet catering, sweets catering. Man, this thing, this sandwich from Game Time Philly, it's not playing around. Oh, <laughs> it's so thick, the bread. Look at that. Mmm. I already knew that it was going to have a kick because they let me try some of the sauces when I was uh, at the food trucks. Yeah, this curry is the special. Um, and I, I got it mainly for my wife so she could try it, but. This bread is killing it. This bread is so good. I probably could have actually used a little more um, 
of the sauce. It's it's really good and it's got a nice kick to it when it's by itself. The bread is so thick. Not a knock on the bread at all because it's good. Mm, and the peppers are really sweet. But the bread is so thick, I think it soaks it all up. And it, it, it's not a bad thing though. It, it kind of knocks down some of that kick a little bit. Man, the star is definitely the, the bread. Let me get some of this. Man, the meat is so tender, like, I couldn't even tell that I was biting. I thought I wasn't getting any meat, but it's just so tender that I'm just, like, biting right through it like nothing. Yep. I was going to only eat a bite because I was going to make sure to eat the nachos because I didn't want the chips to get all soggy, but... Good. Mm. The concept of a curry Philly is uh, new to me. But I like it. Oh, man. You know it's good when you make it a mess. Do -do 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 -do. Got some mustard on my on my hoodie. Or some of the curry, I guess it is. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. If game time Philly, if they come around. Your area, definitely get that. Let me get back to these nachos. I'm not going to sit here and let you guys uh, watch me eat all these nachos. Well, man, I don't know if I'll be able to finish them all, but I'll save some for my, my daughter to try. Shout out to both these food trucks they were up at. Uh, Fairway and Papillion. The Casa was also there, but uh, I couldn't really uh, justify getting food from three different food trucks when it was just me eating. Got a little fat, that's all that was. I like the sauce. You get a lot. Hmm. Not bad at all. I just need a little more like salt or something to come through on the the meat here and the, the mac and cheese. Just need some pepper and some salt, and we'll be all right, I think. Um, yeah. Check those food trucks out, and, and eat well, my friends. Eat well. Peace out, y'all. <laughs>